<laughs> two on the bounce. I mean, again, to come from two goals down. Paul, you're, you're, you seem to be working magic these last couple of weeks now. I think Santos came a wee bit late for us today, but I mean, to come away with an R3-2 win, to, to be two down, to start off brightly again, and two down to come back today, I'm in 3-2 again, especially your first derby. Mm. And for us to win our first game here in a long time, I'm sure it's a, a very happy dress move once again. Well, I think it's the first time in even a victory in four years or something. Yeah, like it's something like that, yeah, since like the last one here. Which is crazy, like... But um, like I'm fairly astounded at players. The players applied themselves fantastically, apart from a wee ten minute spell in the first half where we switched off, and then uh, they scored two goals. Um, after the first one, we're feeling sorry for ourselves. Maybe could have defended it better. Need to look at the video footage to see how we actually did that. And it was two 0 out, and then we had a good, uh, brilliant opportunity to get back into them. Where Chopper scored a great goal. A great goal. Yeah. Um, breaking from he was excellent today, wasn't he? Well, he, he played the captain's role. He was at the. He was at it. He was first. He won his headers. He was, he was aggressive. You know, wanted really what you need in these type of derby matches. And then he actually went through. He was thinking about, we'll, we'll have a, we'll pass it to Michael. Mm. You can see it in him. But he's, I'll have a shot. He's had a shot. This one, I'll, I'll a post. Mm. And that's give us nearly in the stroke of half time. So that's give us a buddy of left going on to talk to players. What did you say in half time? I mean, did you just say just keep a plan what you're doing because we're playing more of an attacking game today again? We talk really more about the culture and about listen. They're, they're a good group of lads. You just feel they, they need a break. And they feel a wee bit sorry for themselves when certain things go, and that's been the way since we've been in. And it's a wee bit of lack of belief and different different reasons because they are good players. Like, mm. so the second half, and as I say, we got we had the bit of the sentence. I don't think they threatened their goal too much in the second half. And then, as I say, we scored two good goals. We we talked to um, Sam about early kicks because we, we played three up, and it, and he done it brilliant for for. Uh, uh, what do you call him, Johnny, Johnny Fraser. Fraser's second goal, because he got on the end of it. Um, Johnny made a brilliant run after Sam's quick kick, and then Michael does what he does best. When he's put in front of the goal, he's very calm, he's very of controlled, course. and we just have to make more chances for Alexa Hummond Spike. But as I say, if you have three forwards like that, that definitely does give you an advantage, and I'm very pleased that we got that that one, which, which the club needs. I mean, the results going the way they did yesterday, but obviously Terry, if you get getting a late point, and then uh, yeah. knock Breda. Yeah. You know, I'm sure that was more fuel for the boys today to go out there and try and at least get something today. But to come away with three two, and it was just fantastic. Yeah, 100. percent No, we needed to do something because all the rest of them st- stepped up yesterday. Mm. Fairness, they they came back from two 0 down as well. Mm. Um, but uh, listen, that's two results in the tr- bounce where the character, the team's been absolutely fantastic. You know, a good, as I said, a good bunch of lads. You just need to be by a break. We do need to get fresh legs on. Um, we probably do. Well, fresh legs come on. We probably might need to move one or two out. Um, but that's football. That's the way the nature of business. But as I say. You know, to get two back to or two ones back to back for the first time under my tenure is, is fantastic, and I think the players deserve it. And make it even sweeter. It's your first derby win too, and your first attempt. Yeah, <laughs> I'm sure it's even better, even sweeter. Lovely. I was told before, and I think now Courage just taken over last year, and um, the Dun the Duns have beat them. Yeah, around the right. Boxing Day, and then they were in a bit of a slump last year mm-hmm. at this time of the year, and then apparently the Welders were up around the top and doing well, and so yep. it's interesting. Like, the, 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 the rules have been reversed. I just hope now that we can kick on. Um, obviously, as I say, we have a big game now on Monday against the best team at the moment in the league at home. Yeah, so we have to obviously carry it on and try and get as many points as we can because of the battle that we're in. But I don't honestly, any team can compete with any team. And as I says, we're interested in a few weeks ahead now because of the transfer wonder and what we can do and what type of business we can do.